Hello everybody, um, welcome. My name is Camilo. I'm the founder and director of Once Upon a Whiskey. Tonight, we're gonna have a whiskey tasting from different whiskies. And well, eventually, at the end of the tasting, my idea is to make you as passionate about whiskey as much as I am. I started to collect stories, you know, like from, from different uh, perspectives, from different point of views, you know, like the, the perspective of the producer, the perspective of the, of the brand manager, the perspective of the brand ambassador. So I started to put all these things together and then I realized that it was some kind of a story to tell. Like Beaumont, Lafroy, Kilhoman, Highland Park here, those are the stairs with the malting floors, ah, okay. which is also like very so, so the stories around whiskey are, are what really set it apart from, from other spirits and what really sort of interests me. Um, you know, gin and vodka, you can, you can make them in a day straight down your throat, straight back up. Um, whereas whiskey, you know, to even be called whiskey, it's got, it's got to earn that right. It's got to spend three years and one day in a cask before you can even call it whiskey. So that sort of effort and the, the sort of the time that's put into them develops stories naturally as well. And, and that's what really sort of interests me and intrigues me about whiskey. Specific amounts of spirits, and the time when approaching whiskey sold the plastics past so many, many years ago, Scottish and Irish, they used to call whiskey as the water of life because it was well known that this beverage, it was able to prolong life and enhance youth. And whiskey, until 1600s more or less, it was consumed as a, as a medicinal drink. It was associated with, with medicine and, and doctors, or they used to cure uh, patients or people like using alcohol. Well, usually people associate whiskey with Scotland and Scottish people. As you can tell, I'm not Scottish. I came all over from Colombia to pass on the passion of whiskey here in, in Scotland. I was lucky enough to have the chance to come here to Scotland. I travel all over Scotland. I visit like different places, towns, and I visited several distilleries. So I discovered that the industry itself is way more than just a, an alcoholic drink. It's like culture, you know, it's like customs, it's, it's people, it's everything all together in one bottle of this um, golden shine, as some people call it. 